Like when you wake up in the morning and you look in the mirror, how much you have to fight the urge to say, wow, these other bitches aren't even close. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another lit video. So today is Saturday, so y'all already know the biz. Today is Stacks on Stacks Saturday. If you guys have not watched my previous video, which was last night, it was Friday night, Money Making Friday, and we made $5,000 in four hours, which is phenomenal, you guys. I'm so freaking grateful. And like I always say, just keep going, keep hustling, and it's all gonna work out in the end. Especially because I had like a little drama situation and I just feel like the heavens, the lords, like they wanted me to just fuck that bullshit and just keep going and shit. So, you know, I got really, really lucky and I'm so freaking blessed that it all worked out and none of that drama shit like matters, you know, so I try to focus on the bag, you know. But yeah, if you have watched my previous video, which was Friday night last night, so that was Money Making Friday, and I ended up making $5,000 within just four hours, you guys. It was so freaking good. I had four hours. All of them were $500 each, and then my first hour, which was all with the same guy, the first hour for $500, he tipped me $1,000. The second hour, he tipped me two thousand the third hour he tipped me another thousand and then the fourth hour he tipped me 500 so it was so super freaking good i'm sorry i'm like stuttering and shit i drink like two red balls <laughs> but um then right after that i literally hit the floor and within like five minutes or so i ended up booking another room which was 30 minute rooms with somebody else for 250 and he tipped me 140 so yeah but yeah, it was such an amazing night. I'm just hoping for the best for today because it's Saturday and Saturday I usually do amazing as well. But recently Fridays have been super phenomenal for me and I've been making hella bread on Friday rather than Saturday. Like last Friday I made 4,000, like 4,500. So it's just been super good you guys. But yeah, we're gonna ponte las pilas today and this is the look for today. I low-key did this look yesterday and my little rhinestones or whatever. I got these rhinestones at, um, I'm trying to look for it. It comes, like, in a pack. Oh, it's right here. It comes in a pack. And it's just, like, different ones, like, little pearls, little different colored diamonds. And these I got at Urban Outfitters in the mall. And they're for hair. So you just stick them on, like, you peel it, you stick it on, and you just put, like, hairspray all over and the hairspray i use it is the yellow can got to be but yeah that is the look and then i just crimp my hair with this crimper i think i got it at walgreens i want to say it is super amazing you guys one of them i got at burlington it was like a cute pink one i low-key only bought it because it was pink and i love pink but it ended up not working it's just sitting in my bathroom it was a piece of shit but yeah this one is from revlon revlon is low-key good like it low-key be working you know what i'm saying but yes, got the extensions in also. Ooh, I gotta get new ones, Loki. I haven't got new ones in a couple of months. And y'all already know I like to switch it up and stuff. And I'm trying to get longer inches. But there's not really any stores around me, like beauty stores that carry like, you know, the Nicki Minaj length. You know what I'm saying? I like that. The booty length. And then also I wanted to show you guys this um, robe. So you guys already know I custom my rows because I just feel like the fur adds so much more like zam, you know what I'm saying? Like a little razzle dazzle. So I got the robe at Lover's Lane for 38 and then I got the little fur at Hobby Lobby. And I just like put it on. This is how it looks. It's giving me angel vibes. I low-key didn't like the white because I just feel like white doesn't look good on me. But then I'm like, maybe if I put some fur on it, you know, boots with the fur, whole club was looking at her. So I just think it's going to be a good night. And, you know, especially with my little, the vibes, you know what I'm saying? The vibes. If you guys want to know exactly how I did it, I actually have a video on my TikTok um, where I did the red one. I got the red robe and then the red feathers or not feathers, um, fur. And I seen this one, it gave me the inspo. I went to one store yesterday and I seen like a long ass robe, it was white, but the fur, it was not fur, it was like feathers and that just looked like, I don't know, I just didn't like the feather because it was like bulky and like itchy. So the fur is like very, you know, soft. 
and yeah i was like f it let me just make my own but yeah i have a video on how i make it like step by step on my tiktok it'll be right here at jenniferv23 so y'all gotta check it out get into it i'm just gonna go ahead and add my lipstick so my fave combo at the moment is i outline my lips and like i mentioned i'm gonna get my lips like done again I don't know i want another syringe this would be my third time doing it but i love big lips so i outlined it with the huda beauty and these are the best you guys if you guys have not tried her liners omg they're so freaking good but then you guys already know i was on a hunch for this it is the dior lip oil in the shade pink but i also had the cherry one so i ended up getting both because i was like girl these are my favorite it is the dior addict lip glow oil and then you know, ooh, before and after but yeah i outline it with this and then i just add this on but yeah you guys these are the vibes i'm okay gonna add my jewelry once i get to work just because um i use like the stockings i don't really know what they're called like they're like called the stock i don't know what the fuck they're called but they go up to like your thigh and then i just put my ankle bracelets like on top of that it looks so freaking good this guy on my stage that he was like those ankle bracelets hidden they look so good i'm like yeah think sabe but yeah and then my little belly chain oh no i'm not gonna wear the belly chain because i'm gonna wear my like it's like the chest um the little chest piece the sparkly one from victoria's secret and then that but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and pack my bag and then i will see you guys once we get to work Stacks on stack Saturday. Let's get it. We in this bitch. That's what I'm saying. Today is fire as fuck though. Period. It was. Okay guys, so this is an update. Let me just tell y'all. It was freaking amazing. It was freaking amazing. And I'm sorry I couldn't really like vlog for you guys it's just because i was busy okay i mean i did have like a little downtime in the beginning because in the beginning low-key there was just like a lot of people watching and stuff and it was just not it you know what i'm saying it was not it for anybody but then my regular came and he ended up doing 30 minutes with me for 250 and then he's so dope though like you know i really like his um Como se dice, like presence you know what i'm saying and then when i was talking to him afterwards i seen this guy coming in and we, i was sitting in the vip section and this guy came in i'm just like he looks familiar and i was like once a man looks familiar to me why did my life sitting with my regular and then um since the guy was like 10 feet away from me like behind me a little bit this girl went up to him and within a couple minutes he had i guess said no so she ended up walking away or whatever and i went i told my regular i was like i'll be right back like let me see what's up so i ended up going to the guy and um he looked super familiar once i got close to close because y'all know i'm blind as fuck i don't see shit and then i was like hey i remember you he's like yeah i remember you too i came back for you and i was like okay period and then i was like how's your day blah blah a little small conversation it only took me like a minute to get him to get him in the hour and then um he was like yeah i came back for you and i was like okay we gotta have a good time you know you gotta spend some time with me and he's like okay yeah what do you have in mind and i was like i mean we go ahead and do that hour you know he's like yeah let's go and i was like let's go so i ended up going to the hour with him for 500 and he tipped me 1000 and then right after that hour he got another hour this is the vip suite again for 500 and then for that room also he tipped me a thousand so i got a thousand for the room and two thousand for the tip but obviously i don't keep the full thousand for the room out of the room they're both 500 each i would keep 300 from both of them so i would only have gotten 600 from the rooms yeah i know so for both rooms, I only got six hundred plus the thousand, the two thousand dollar tip. So I got twenty six hundred from him, and then I ended up hitting the floor again. Yeah, so I spent two hours with him. He tipped me super freaking good, and um, I ended up hitting the floor again. 
And I was like, where's all my bitches at? Like, you know, once you hit the floor, you just be like scanning the room, you know what I'm saying? But also looking for your girls, like to check on them, you know? I like to check on my girls or check on girls who have came in and used my name as a referral, just like to make sure they're okay if they need any help, questions or anything like that. So I ended up fighting some, like some of the girls. And I was just like, how's your night going? Blah, blah, blah. And then um, we ended up going to this group together and we got six songs off of them because at, at this point it was literally 30 minutes no not even 30 minutes less than 30 minutes left of the club before it closed so we got six songs for 175 and he tipped us 100 each so it was me and two other girls like this whole weekend was freaking amazing you guys like omg like so nobody calls cap on me and i have like some club cash because since the room was at the middle i mean the end of the shift um they had to give us these fake bills and i couldn't i didn't have time to exchange it because they closed it at five but literally i just shan't shammed i just jammed all my money in here <laughs> all these gums but like a single Yes, boo boo, come through, come through, come through. And Loki, I was rushing because once I was exchanging my uh, bills for the PBs, I was changing my PBs for the real money. They were like stormy next on stage. Since it was like a lot of PBs because it was like over $2,000 that I had to exchange. Um, They were like stormy next on stage, stormy. So I was like fuck like i'm over here trying to exchange all this money and it takes time because there's only one girl in the front and you know like it was over two thousand dollars so you know and she still had to check in the customers that were walking in so i was like trying to freaking rush and shit but at the same time i didn't want to rush her you know because i understand so i'm like fuck and then like i had to run all the way backstage hop on stage like it was it was a lot Tan Tan, 20s in the 50s, bitch. Rack City, bitch. Rack, Rack City, bitch. <laughs> okay, so let me just do my mathematics real quick for y'all. I'm just trying to make sure, like, there's no extra bills in here. And I took out the singles just because, like, it's really, these are the only singles I had. I didn't really go on stage. I only went on stage once in the beginning and once in the end. So, but yeah. Okay, so I'm just trying to sum up how much I made within today and yesterday. Today I made about 20, a little bit over, no, 2,700 ish, a little bit over, but okay, so. 5,000 from yesterday plus, oh, let me just make sure this is right. Okay, okay so I made a little bit over 2,700 last night, but we're just gonna say 2,700. So 5,000, which I earned on Friday, plus the 2,700 I got last night, I'm walking out with 7,700 for two days, you guys. Two days. Blessed, never stressed. And low key, like, I really, I really hustled, bro, because Friday, y'all already know, like, I was saying that I don't want to dig into my savings account because I need new couches. I need new couches. Ashley Furniture is having a sale. It ain't no damn sale, but they're having a sale. And I want some new couches. I didn't want to dig in my savings account. So I'm like, okay, Friday, I'm going to hustle my ass. And the money I make on Friday, I'm going to use to buy my couches. So it all freaking worked out. I made way more than what I planned on making. Which, I mean, you never really plan on making, like, you know? But you just hope for the best. You already know, like, my goal for every time I work is $2,000. And to surpass that for both days, it's insane, like... 7,700 for two days, y'all. Come on now. You can't beat that. But, um, yeah, it was 
such an amazing night and both of the guys actually because i mainly got the the seventh oh, i'm sorry i'm brain farted i'm so hungry i mainly got the money the ugh, why do i keep stuttering i mainly got most of my money last night off of the guy that i was like hey i know you or whatever and yeah you know like without fees being taken out i got the two thousand dollar tip plus the thousand dollar for the room so i got three thousand dollars off him but i don't keep the whole three thousand you know so although there was people at the club they were not quality people you know i just got really lucky and i feel super freaking blessed and this is what i mean like not everybody had a good day there was people at the club but they were not trying to spend a lot of girls went home you know so for me to freaking make that shit like I'm just so freaking grateful and blessed. Like, y'all don't even understand. Like, this is what I mean. Like, it's not luck. You got to make your own luck. But at the same time, it's like, I don't know. You know, the first time I met this guy, he was like, you're definitely my type, blah, blah, blah. Like, everybody has their own type, you know? And I think that's what it is. They come in there looking for their certain type. And last time I was just his type. So this time it wasn't hard or anything to get him you know he instantly wanted he told me he came for me and i'm just like oh, okay dope and friday is the same thing you know like i would i guess call both of them regulars you know because friday i made most of my money off that one guy because he got four hours with me every hour is 500 dollars each so i got 2000 for the four hours since 500 500 500 500 and then he tipped me like 2000 he tipped me 3500 on top of the rooms, you know? So, <sighs> y'all, I swear, like, I don't know. People be telling me, like, why do you go so ready to work? Like, your hair is so, like, because I be doing the most. Y'all see, like, I be doing the most. But it's like, I don't know. I want to I wanna stand out. You know, I like standing out. I don't like looking the same as everybody, I guess you could say. But... I'm just so freaking grateful and blessed. Like, y'all don't even understand. Today I have um, club cash, so I can pay my house with this. I don't got to dig into any of my savings accounts. Okay, y'all, so we're literally going to deposit all of this. And low-key, I'd be watching my surroundings like crazy because people are wild, so. But yeah. But yeah, excuse the mess, by the way, you guys. I'm literally going to spend my day cleaning, run some errands, grocery shop, you know. I have some movers coming in. Today is Sunday. I have them coming in Wednesday morning. So it's going to be such a busy day. They're going to go ahead and move the couches that I currently have. My sister's talking about some, girl, we could have moved that shit ourselves. I'm like, who? I'm not moving shit. I got a bad back. Like, <laughs> She's like, you're doing too much. I was like, no, bitch, I got a bad back. Like, what the fuck? Y'all don't understand. Like, my back sucks. Like, it sucks. I got a bitch back. A bitch back. <laughs> no, but um, it's going to be a busy-ass week for me, low-key. And then I got, I'm going to um go to Ashley's Furniture, and I'm going to get some couches. But they're going to deliver it, and they're going to bring that shit up here. I made sure to call, and I was like, okay, so are they going to bring it up here? Are they going to set it up? You know what I'm saying? Obviously, it's an extra cost, but girl... We gonna get on that. But y'all probably tired of my ass already. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog right here. So brain fart. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go to Subway. I'm super hungry. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And as so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Love you guys. Bye.